Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, we'll be learning how to move your phone screen to your computer. Um, the application we'll be making use of is not a graphical user interface, it's a command line interface. Uh, I'm a programmer, and that's what programmer like, um, if you understand what I mean. So, um, the name of the application is Screen Copy. It is pronounced Screen Copy, but it is written S A R C P Y. So here is the application, I will leave the link in the description so you can download that. Um, so the application is a very nice application, you could screen mirror your phone to your computer over IDP debugging mode or through TCP IP internet protocol. Um, I will make sense, I personally prefer IDP debugging mode because it's just straightforward, I just connect my cable and that's it. Um, you could just read all over because if I should um, start explaining each, each options um, available here, yeah, this video will be too lengthy, so I'll just make this video a very short one. So basically, all you need to do is connect your phone and just run this. That's if you're on command line from anyway but if you've downloaded the application all right first of all let's download the application all you need to do is scroll up click on this and click on download so i've downloaded mine here is mine um so i'll just extract so i extract all you need to do is just double click on this and your application should be up and running so right now um my ADB, my debugging mode is currently activated on my computer i make use of a journey less than light so um okay i'll just i'll just show you for the purpose of this tutorial i'll just show you how how to enable the debugging mode um debugging mode on your phone so here it is it, it should just run because my adb uh, my debugging mode is activated already that's why it's it's just connected straight up and just started running all right for for you to enable your debug mode on your computer you need to go to your settings you need to scroll down more settings you should see developer options if your develop developer option isn't activated yet you should go to about phone or about devices this may vary on um, your devices you should scroll down when you see build number you tap on build number for about four or five times I'm a developer already as you can see so it's telling me I'm, a, I'm already a developer so I have to go back go to my settings scroll down and click on developer options then scroll down a little you should see developer options here developer options here all you need to do is activate that and you should, then you should get a little pop-up um, on your screen saying allowing a, a device to connect your phone whatever whatever just grant access and that is it guys so whenever you so I'm just close this so whenever you need to just run the application all you need to do is just double click on this and it should run like this and it should open up if that makes sense all right so that will just be it for this tutorial guys i mean i could go on explaining each and every one of these options here for this video be too lengthy i mean you could record your screen you could do so many things with this application um, so i'll just go a little bit down here there are more options more things that i can do on, on using this application so um take for example let me pin my on top so you can only see that so um there are so many things you can do you can copy from your phone to the computer and you can copy from the computer likewise onto the phone back how that makes sense um maybe it's a text or anything you could you, you could copy it so right here are shortcuts for the application so this is my application it says um, click on home this home means to go back to the home home screen on the phone so what this mode represents is your left alt key on the keyboard we have two alt keys 
this is all this is the left hold and this is the right hold so all you need to do is click on the left hold and as it says here mod h so left hold and h so i'll do that left hold and h okay i have to do that again left hold and h as you can see it went back to my home so there's so many things that could be done but i don't want to make the video very lengthy so thank you guys for watching my tutorial um if you're new to my channel welcome um please consider hitting the subscribe button liking the video turn on post notification so that i can get to be notified whenever i upload content like this um thank you guys i'll see you guys in my next video peace out